Hello FSM team. This is a video on how to add and edit webinars to the resources section of the website. So you can get there here in the drop down or you can hit resources and you can click on one of this one of these tabs to get to it. But uh, we'll be looking at this new treatment paradigm as the example. So when you come to the back end of the website, you find that right here on the left hand side in the menu under webinars. And as with pages and posts and many other things, you'll just see a complete list uh, of everything that that is here. Um, you can come up here and change the screen options to have a different number of uh, items show per page so that you can see them all at once. Um, and if we click into the new treatment paradigm option, here's how these things line up. So uh, let's go back here actually. So this item right here, this text that we see, this introduction, that is the category text. That's what shows up in this blue bar that comes across the bottom of the image. This obviously is the title, which shows up both here underneath the image, and it shows up at the top of the page once you've clicked into that item. Over here on the right hand side is where you load the image, the featured image for that post, which of course is what shows up right here in the archive. If you've got some text that you want to use to introduce that, you would put that right here. That would show up between this back to all webinars and the image here, just a little bit of text to explain to somebody uh, if you need something more than the title. PDF embeds. So obviously all of these items down here are all, or usually they're often PDFs. Um, this would be if you want to actually embed, have an actual PDF, not just available for download, but visible on the page. This is where you would put that. The featured video, obviously, is what shows up right here. And so that's where you put in your, um, your link for that. The field has an explanation right here, so you want the direct link to um the the featured video um you don't want embed code so uh just like this player.vimeo.com um here we've got an audio file player and an audio file link that is what is showing up here here's the download and here's the player And then we've got all of these downloadable materials. So here is where you enter the label for the button, and here is where you enter the link for the button. So for each of these audio, slides, transcript, etc., you can see we've just entered the name for it here and the link for it here, name for it here, link for it here. You can change the order of these if you want to by just dragging them up or down on the list. You can add more by just clicking Add Row right down here, and it adds a blank row here for you. You can't save this with the row being blank. So if you're going to, you know, if you end up adding a row and then you don't put anything in here and you make some other changes, you'll need to remove this first. Just like that. That is pretty much really all that there is to it. Uh, a lot of these resources items are going to be similar, but we're going to make separate videos for each one just to, uh, to make sure everything is perfectly clear for it. Thanks.